just listened to a snippet of Wasters. If you enjoyed what you heard, then go and find us on any streaming site that you can think of. I hope you enjoy the music and I hope you enjoy the video. Hello and welcome to Metal Band Reacts. It's been a minute because we're lazy and also ah! busy. Oh, oh, it's Ben. He wasn't in the last ones. He came back. I know. James isn't the singer of the band anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what? What happened? Oh, Did you, you kick me out? You'd never need to know. Oh, okay. <laughs> we killed James. Died in the shower anyway. When the walls closed in on him anyway. So we're all good. Oh God. <laughs> this time we're listening to uh, Spirit Box. Uh, fuck, I should have prepared this. Ben, can you pass, pass, pass that, please? Oh, fucking hell, mate. That's so far away. It's not that far away. Oh! <laughs> Just as a little show and tell. I've been putting off this as this album because I wanted to uh, react to it. But I like Spirit Box so much, I decided to get the actual vinyl. Ooh, ooh, isn't it pretty? It's got a really nice, like, inner booklet thing with all the actual CD art on Show it. them the vinyl, Kyle! Yeah, it's got the CD art on it. I can't see because it's in the way. <laughs> I'm in the way of the camera. But it looks nice. It looks pretty. Uh, it's got Secret Garden on, which if you don't listen to Chubcast, you should because we've already listened to that song. And I listen to it almost every day because it's a fucking banger Uh And it's got Holy Roller on, which obviously everybody who knows Spirit Box knows. And we did a reaction to that previously. We did. Uh, it's a very cool looking vinyl as well. I'm just going to show that off just to. Go on, mate. You could do it. Uh, Go on, I believe I don't want to damage it. It's 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 precious. Precious. My precious. Look at that. Oh, green. that is very pretty. Green. Ooh, wow. wow. It looks like puke. That's what it sounds like too. <laughs> Just the whole time she's just doing open. vocals, she's just like bleh, bleh, bleh. That's all our vocals sound like in Chubb, which if you haven't listened to, we're in a band, Chubb. Uh, I'm sure I'll have linked a thing at the beginning anyway. But give us a listen, please. We're recording our album right now. Yeah. It's gonna slap. We've got our first gig in just under a month. We're very excited. Mm, but I'm anyway. I'm very excited. I'm so excited. I've got a big old boner. <gasps> I'm so fucking pumped! But right now, right now we're going to listen to Spirit Box, and That's we're going right. to listen to uh, their most recent single off of Eternal Blue, their debut album, and it's called "Hurt You." Hurt you. Hurt you. Please don't hurt me. Hurt me good. Uh, or yeah. All right, sick. Let's give it a go. <laughs> I'm gonna turn it. They've always got their very edgy, we're in an insane asylum videos. The classic. Every band's got the a classic somewhere. If you have... Okay. Okay. Oh. oh! Oh, he's wearing underwear. I was going to say, we're going to get demonetized. Definitely, I thought they were doing something else then. Oh, they're doing a kiss. Oh, they're all oh, slimy. God, Why are they all... I was what? noticing, on their, their eyelashes have like goo on them. Ah. That's, uh, I mean, doesn't everyone's eyelashes start gooing when they're horny? <laughs> Uh, my eyes just suddenly go. <laughs> At the same time as like your fanny gets wet, your eyes are just like. Yeah. Just, oh, my God. eye mucus. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Doesn't everyone just excrete m mucus out of every pore of their body when they get when they get aroused? Fucking excrete. No. What a word. And just me. What a word. <laughs> um, I one one thing I noticed. I can't open this fucking bottle. Go on. Mate. <laughs> I, I don't think this bottle opener is built for this bottle. You could do it. I could do it. You got I, this. I, I'm nearly there. Got this. Oh my god. Hey. What the fuck? Um, I noticed the other day, Spirit Box sound kind of uh, architecty. Did you notice that? Yeah. 
Yeah. They've got their, uh, like, they're, like, soaring, like, boom, and then they've got, like, the keys, like, doo -doo 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 -doo, in the background. It's, like, very yeah. architects. Yeah. Uh, which is probably why I like them. It's probably, it's, I mean, that's, that's, surely that's kind of indicative of, of like, British, like, metal core, I guess, really, like, in general, where it's just like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, and then and it's just like, ah, like, in the chorus. Yeah. I mean, like, Spirit Box are, like, I think they're Canadian. But, right, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. I did not know that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I think we found this out last time. Let's listen to the rest of the song. I'm going to keep pausing anyway because you have to do it because YouTube hates people listening to music. <laughs> it just but hates people. It hates people. Yeah, it's like much. no tube. That doesn't even make sense. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't even just goo. They, that was like spaghetti. Oh, God. <laughs> We're just sharing some cheese string. Oh, <laughs> it's like the peeling skin. I like that little. Yeah! Okay. Oh no, don't do that. That's. Uh, oh, she's blue. Going towards some sort of crazy shit. Interesting lyrics. Mm. Um, yeah. Was well, she saying I'm only happier when? I'm... She says, "I hope you find what you're looking for. Or I'm happier when I hurt you." Ah. So it sounds like is this is like a breakup kind of song, like or maybe yeah, it's like or it's like it's like a toxic relationship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sounds like it sounds like a toxic relationship kind of thing. Yeah. Which she's actually just re really kinky and people are kink shaming. <laughs> um. <laughs> Something about like the first thing I noticed was the way that she sings that happy like that that way she delivers that it's really yeah, cool like yeah. that's like she does it on like every t time she does it but it sounds really cool mm. keeps it dynamic yeah I, I I think a lot of um what makes for a really great chorus as well is like having those like extra bits of a chorus it's almost like a chorus yeah, part two like an extended like chorus. an extended yeah, bit yeah yeah I was thinking like like yeah I I really like that kind of stuff because like so many. So many different sort of bands utilize that where like they'll um kill switch does it quite a bit actually where like they'll have the first bit of a chorus but then like they'll go straight back into the verse but then when they do it the second or third time it'll be like the first bit and like another added bit yeah which is like extended and it's just like oh okay. yeah we should try yeah yeah well. it's, it's just so like, every time it just kicks in like all right because it's like They've kind of lulled you into that sense of like, oh, it's the chorus. Now we're going back into this. And it's like, no. Yeah, yeah. We're going to do the chorus, but harder. But harder and more melodic. Yeah. And it sounds sick. The chorus -ier. I suppose because it's just like, like, especially because choruses tend to be like the, the, the focal point of a lot of songs and hooks, mm. like extending it kind of. It's just interesting from a music theory point of view. This probably, this isn't new to like people who I guess make music, but like, it's just really interesting to see how, how they did it as a band really well. Yeah, I think Spirit Box have done it a few times, like Secret Garden as well, like the, the very ending chorus that, it could all be us. Yeah. Uh, 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> That's but true. yeah, it's so sick, like that last bit, because it's just built up so well, and it just goes even further. Yeah. Keeps building even further. But yeah. Sounds like it's about to yeah, break I'm, it I'm, down. I'm, I'm happy for some beef. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. I get it on there. See very, very cat. See where it's in It's that weird owl. <laughs> 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 I was, saying, I was just like, that guy looks kind of funny. I was just like, imagine if he was. He just turns to the camera and he's just like, <laughs> This is the wackiest thing I've done yet. <laughs> Putting keys in bitches' mouths. <laughs> like, this, is, this is the weirdest thing I've ever done. Uh, I've ever weirdest been owl. Peak weird owl. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on in this video. It's very strange, but it's very... Uh, Dark, Kyle. It's a... Uh, what's, that, what's that reference? It's like a... It's evocative, and it's, that's what the kids want! It's evocative, it gets the people going! Yeah. <laughs> provocative. That's provocative. It's provocative. It's provocative. I was thinking, like, the, the breakdown is very simple, but that's all you want. You just want to get... And it goes on for a while. Like, we've, we've kind of had the discussion in, amongst ourselves for a while. Like, mm. how long should a riff go on for before mm. people get bored? Mm. But it's like... This 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 breakdown goes on for like a good like forty seconds, mm. and it, and it's literally it's just. <laughs> but it's so beefy, you just forgive it. You know, it doesn't. You don't even notice that it's that long. It has yeah, switch it up as well, yeah. yeah, yeah. Maybe that's what it is. It's like, you know, you can you can keep a riff going, like, because because you want a riff like this to go on for a while, because people are just mm. it's the sort of riff you just sit there and just go. Mm. Uh, yeah, you know for a fact, like the crowd is <laughs> is either moshing their fucking lives out, or if they're not moshing, they're like jumping. Everyone around is just like, mm, 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 like <laughs> like just feeling the fucking groove. Yeah, and the thing is, it's like yeah, we've had this discussion loads where it's about how long is too long for a riff, and at the end of the day, it like there isn't a fucking. Like There's no set in stone formula. No. Yeah, like it's just how how like how you're feeling it. Yeah, like it's it's just a feeling, and and at the end of the day, if it's one of these like breakdowny kind of riffs, like sometimes it just feels better to just like let it play out a bit, so you could just be like, oh yeah, yeah, exactly. because because I feel like if if this like only went on for like half the amount of time, it wouldn't like necessarily be as good. I wouldn't um, have the same impact. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Mm. And that, that that the kind of I guess it was a key change sort of thing as well, where it, where it went even lower. It was like do do, and then it went do do do. Yeah. And I'm just like, oof. Okay. Oof. Yeah. Taking taking some notes. Taking yeah. some notes. Yeah. Maybe that's the answer to all of our like, is this riff too long? We just need to switch it up a little. Yeah. 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 Because yeah, like, maybe it would have felt too long if it was just exactly the same. Yeah. But, yeah. but if you kind of like slight key changes or like 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 rhythm or anything like that might might add a bit of a yeah. Let's ride this gravy train to the end. Let's get past pregnant ladies key weird Al Yankovic. Weird. Over here. <laughs> Very sudden ending. Nice. That was big beefy boy. I really liked the like, because you said at the beginning you were like, God, that's a horrible sound. 
I think it's really cool. Admittedly, it was a horrible sound when we had it at max volume. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because it, it was going Give it just... a little bit of fucking... <laughs> like my fucking brain is melting. Reminds me of when we did the escape room the other day and we had that... Oh, yeah. And I was just like... Ah! <laughs> it's like this hand siren or whatever. Yeah, definitely... Um... <laughs> maybe put like an audio warning on, on that bit when you turn it on. <laughs> oh, mate, nah, everybody likes a bit of just a jump scare and then <laughs> yeah look at uh, fucking see I've been I've been waiting to listen to this for some some time oh yeah and I'm gonna go and I'm gonna fucking like this song right now hey oh, oh. there yeah, you I, go I swore it was a single but I literally didn't know that there was a video for it until just now also, can we talk about Sun Killer? What a hardcore name that is. Yeah. And they got a song with Sam Carter for, from Architects. Uh, what a coinky yeah. dink. Yeah. Uh, a couple of people that I've been following on on Instagram have been like posting a lot of um, a lot of the songs that I haven't heard from this this album on on, on Instagram. So yeah, I definitely need. I'm gonna give the whole album a listen. I've obviously heard a lot of the singles, which have been slappers. But yeah, maybe I mean maybe this could be one for a suggestion for Chubcast, maybe. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say that. This is another video, or is the, it just? A, oh, it's probably just a lyric thing. It looks like, it? yeah, because there's quite a few of them. It looks I think, like I think we should things. listen to another one though. Should we? So, what's the most listened to song of this album? It's Holy Roller, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Holy Roller. It's hurt you. Circle with me, Constance. These have all been out for ages. Yeah. But yeah. then besides that, Yellow Jacket. Let's give Yellow Jacket a listen. Do they have it. They do have it on. <laughs> This is more Holy Roller sort of style. Ooh. Oh, big red. Goosebumps there. Isn't it funny? Like, Ooh. like, <laughs> it's like, what should we do for the verse riff? How about? Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> that's all it has to be sometimes and the vocals are like very downplayed very sort of it's to me it sounds it sounds so like it's very like industrial industrial I was yeah. gonna say that like the way she's delivering it and like the minimalist sort of like dicka, 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 in the background is so Trent Reznor yeah yeah like like that sounds so Nine Inch nails -y, it's unreal dude that fucking riff is sick and though. then it just slaps into it Oh. Yeah, that did it. That bit, I was just like, oh. oh it sounds oh. almost fucking like Egyptian, like Middle East, like. like oh. Yeah, yeah. I love that. Just that one note, that dong at the end as well. I'm like, how? How is that just an open? <laughs> Yeah. yeah, it must be like an open... We need to get Greg on that hype. We need Greg to We need to some riffs like this. So So 
so cool they made a song about Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> this yellow jacket. <laughs> I, Perforate me like Scorpion. Get over here. Get over here. <laughs> it's it's uh, definitely... Um, very architect I mean, you said yeah. that about like the previous song, and then lo and behold, yeah, yeah. here's Sam, Sam Carter. Here's Sam Carter, basically. Like, uh, I, I would have liked. So, I mean, not judging a book by its cover, because obviously there's still a bit of the rest of the song left. But I would have liked maybe like a duet of both of them singing at the same time. Oh yeah, that would have been cool. I wonder um, if oh, like, it's, it'd be a bit of a shame if he like kind of just did a verse it, and was like, "All right, I'm done." Yeah, if he if he if he just sort of takes over the chorus without her like also having her singing like. It would have been like maybe maybe they harmonise in the next one. I'm not sure. Like, yeah, we'll we've see. only heard it for the first time so far, so we'll see. But it would be really nice if they both if they were both like because they they're, they're both like heavy like like strong strong singers in like their choruses and stuff. So mm. yeah, so far this one's hitting quite a bit harder. Than yeah, the previous yeah. One. The previous one was also very good. Hurt you was also very good. Yeah. But this one's like hitting different. Like just that main note. The, <laughs> yeah, the guitarists need so to need sick. to pat themselves on the back. Is it one or do they have one or two? I, I, I think it's just one. I think there's only like four people in the band. Oh, bro. Let me double check. Let me double check. They are Canadian. They're from British Columbia. Yeah, there's four of them. Four. Yeah, four of them. Fucking hell. Considering it's one guitar, it sounds fucking huge. Yeah, yeah, it sounds big. Beefy, big chungus. Let's finish the song. Hoping for a hum. Stopper. That was good. Yeah, they. they I, I wonder if the album like kind of flows into other parts because that both those songs ended very suddenly. But yeah, I I, I like it. That was a, a big beefcake of yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. That was super beefy, and it was uh, yeah. It was <laughs> God proper. damn that chunky. That though. chunky though. It absolutely was. Nick. Whatever your name is. Nick was. Nocturnal. <laughs> uh. Sam coming over the Daybreaker era vocals again. Daybreaker was a banger album. Uh, this song is Silk and the Strings are my favourites. I, I mean, I, I want to listen to another one, but we're going a bit long already. So, we're going to leave it at that. If we fancy listen to more Spirit... I'm going to listen to it in my own time, TBH, Soz. But I hope you enjoyed. Uh, both songs absolutely slapped, as I knew they would. Uh, if you liked it, give us a like and a subby, please. Uh, we've got some bangerangers coming out soon like not that soon we're recording like we've got like half the drums done we've just started on uh we've got a bit of bass done we're starting on guitars on like the earlier songs so mm-hmm. probably i'd like to get it out this year that would be nice but no promises we're not even able to fucking do reactions on the regular let alone <laughs> record on the regular boys so it'll be out when it's ready hot and oven fresh just like brexit oh god i love Brexit. <laughs> I love fucking ready Brexit. I love mm, Brexit. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go take a Brexit. shit. Oh, let's go. <laughs> like and subscribe. Love you long time. Peace out. Goodbye. Ah!